Welcome to the NetSuite training video provided by Trustangle Company. My name is Sarah Siofi, and in today's video, we will be going over how to create new account in NetSuite. To see all your accounts, you have to go to the lists, accounting, and click accounts. Here you can see a list of all your accounts and you can click edit or view for each account. You can see the inactives account by clicking on show inactives and you can export this chart of account by Excel or CSV. To create a new account, click on a new. For the account number field, we have to write the same account number on which the chart of account was built. For the account name field, this name will appear in the chart of account list, transactions list, and the report lists. For the subaccount of field, if this account is a subaccount of another one, select the parent account in this field. And as you can see, the type of account has automatically changed to be the same type of the parent account and you cannot choose different type for the child account. And if this field is not a child account, you will choose the type manually. And also, as you can see, some fields are changing with the changing of the account type. For the currency field, if this account type is bank account, Select the currency to associate it with this account. If you use multiple currencies feature and want to be able to select this account for re-evaluation, check this box. You can also write description for that account. For the date, enter the date of the opening balance for that account and it defaults to the current date and you can modify it as necessary. Summary checkbox. Summary accounts are useful when you want to create a non-posting inactive parent account for reporting purpose. And checking the summary box will automatically inactive that account. And you can also inactive that account without making this account summary. If you want to restrict this account for a specific department, class, or location, choose them in these fields. And after that, this account can be selected only on transactions where those segments are also selected. For the subsidiary, important note, for bank account type, it is subsidiary specific and we cannot choose more than one subsidiary. Write the bank account number. For showing fixed asset management field, if this account considered to be used with FAM module, select the fixed asset account type that this account applies to. Important note, we cannot change the type after creating this account. When you finish, click save. Now going back to the account that we created from the chart of account list. And we will click on edit. For the bank account type, you will see one additional checkbox for reconciliation purpose. And you can add any new fields in the accounting setup. And the trust angle has add-on bundle to apply an approval workflow for adding a new account in NetSuite. Thank you for watching. This video was brought to you by Trust Angle Team.